So the beta for Enfield just ended, and I gotta say, man, this one has potential. I plan on making a review base on my experience from the beta, so I won't bore you here with the details. Instead, though, I'd like to introduce you guys to my favorite character from the beta, Chen Xianyu. Right? Chen is a physical damage, lattice sword user, who specializes at single target lift damage. The extent of her lattice ability is pretty limited. She is capable of generating lattice orbs, but she can't detonate them herself. So bring a capable teammate like the Endman to make use of them. Her basic attack is pretty standard, just a three-string combo. Her main skill ascending strike is a rising uppercut that lifts the target into the air. If the target's stability bar, the white bars above their health bar is broken, she have a 30% chance to generate a lattice orb. Like I mentioned before, she can interact with this orb herself, so her teammates will have to play around it. After her skill is cast, you can launch her pursuit attack by basic attacking to deliver a powerful follow-up attack. Switching party members before you use the pursuit attack will void it, and it's a big part of her damage, so be sure you use it before switching to a different operative after casting her main skill. You don't have to use it instantly after casting the main skill. So if you are in danger, you can move out of the way and your next attack will be the pursuit. Her ultimate, Blade Gale, will inflict lift on the target and unleash a flurry of attacks against them. You can cast the ultimate and swap characters without any penalty. And of course, her passive Sky Sweep gives her a 30% bonus damage against lifted targets. Her and Angelina are a match made in heaven due to their heavy lift mechanics. We do have her signature weapon here, and as you guys can see, it just feeds into that pursuit attack playstyle, granting her a 50% increase to her crit rate when performing a pursuit attack, and increases her attack by 40% and crit damage by a ridiculous 80% after causing pursuit attack damage. Needless to say, our girl hits very hard. For our essence, we did try to get a crit rate essence, but I couldn't get a high crit rate roll to drop for the sword class. I have some with like plus 30% crit, but they just don't work on her weapons. Fortunately for me, gear sets more than made up for that shortcoming. I don't know what the highest rarity of gear is. There might be gold gear, it's hard to say, but just these purple were pretty insane. I got these from completing missions, exploring the world, and via the mail. You can actually craft gear sets back in your base, but I could only craft green and blue gear likely due to progression limitations. You can also get them from completing special rifts, but some of those don't have set effects. It's hard to say if there will be a gear domain since they don't have random rolls. At least anything below purple don't. These last two perks are base related. You can glance them if you want. Potential is likely Constellations, but it was locked during beta, so we don't know. And lastly, we have her personnel file. I can't stress enough how much I love this game's UI. Everything is just so clean. It feels like ascending to a new stage of martial perfection. I love it. All right, with that out of the way, let's show some gameplay. Her play style is pretty simple. Basic attack, cast your skill, after casting your skill, follow up with your pursuit attack. Not landing your pursuit is a pretty big DPS loss, especially if you have her signature weapon, cast your ultimate on the beefiest guy on the field since it can't be stored. That's pretty much it. I hope you future Chen Xianyu mains found this video useful. If you did, consider leaving a like to feed the algorithm and subscribe for more videos like this. Until we meet again, friends. They're putting up a decent fight. They're putting up a decent fight. Let's get working. <laughs>